Hello everybody, it's Rhonda. Welcome to my channel. I am here with a short video. A few weeks ago, I did a Saturday morning mates um, and I was going to do a giveaway of a little dangle that I had made. So all you had to do was leave a comment and your name would be put in the drawing. So these are the people that left a comment on that video. So I am going to pull a name today and then I will show what would have been my Saturday morning makes. Um, I had a busy weekend. I didn't get to do Saturday morning makes on Saturday morning because I went to a event that was a retirement for our our elder of our district. Um, we are a AME Zion, and we are spread all over the United States and other countries. And um, we have our well person that's over the churches that are consider our district and um he had been there prob I think about over 15 years and he was the best elder he was real personable and everything and for him to just be over all of the churches he just it was like he had a relationship with everybody so um he was honored Saturday and it was kind of like a little black tie event so he gave me a chance to dress up a little bit so I spent Saturday getting ready for the uh, event and it was good it um helped me with my little stress level and everything so um I am going to do my Saturday morning makes in this video and then I will do the giveaway. So this was the dangle that I made where well, you can call it a tassel dangle. Uh, so it had pom-pom, there were snowflakes, some of these little ornaments here. Uh, I also did uh, this dangle that I added um, a little jar with some sequences, candy canes, um, jingle bells, um, this little wooden piece here, um, different little ribbons. So I put the number on the papers down here. And uh, again, these were the names. So I just mixed these up a little bit. And there were seven names, so the number is number three, and number three was Crafty Bean, and that is her channel. So, Tina, um, please leave a message, uh, comment below, and we will see about getting this dangle out to you and I want to thank everybody that participated and now I want to show you but first I purchased the little Jill's Joyful Heart Angel Stamp and um, I received it Friday and I would have liked to do this for my Saturday morning mates, but I did not have a chance to really, really, you know, pull some papers and stuff together. So I will be using this um, later on this week if I get a chance or either this will be my Saturday morning mates for next week. And um, this stamp is so cute and 
I love angels, one of my favorite things, and Jill knows that about me. So I am so glad that she had um, this cute little angel stamp. So thank you, Jill. And thank, um, uh, is it Peachy King that does the stamp? Um, yes, Peachy King stamp. And then, as you know, I had found this bag of rolling pins at a yard sale a few weeks ago, about a week ago. But, um, I was trying to think of some things I could do. So, what I did is, um, I wrapped a few with some paper and I'm going to decorate these and I will come back and show you what I was doing with these. So when I was making these, I thought about, you know, what if you made a little dangle to go with them. So not that I'm going to use them with these, but all I did is I used some scrapbook paper and I don't, that pad is not here with me, but um, it was a gingerbread little paper pad. So I used some of the paper off of, well, out of that pad. So these were the little dangles that I made thinking I was going to use it for that. But um, this one has a little, little gingerbread guy. There are some little jingle bells. And these are some images at Harala Me Shop. And I know I'm probably not saying it right, but these are some of the little digitals. And um, the little sentiment was, um, this one has Merry Gingerbread Season. And I just folded it over, and on this side, it says, it's gingerbread season, if it will focus. So, a little jingle, gingerbread. There's a button at the top, and I just used a little random ribbon that was in my stash. And um, this little tiny rick rat. Um, my daughter was out of town Saturday and, um, they were close by a Hobby Lobby and I realized I did not have any Rick Rat, well, red and green. I was just about out. So, um, I asked her to look and see did Hobby Lobby have any and they only had the little thin rolls. Well, she did, she found, um, these, and then there was one of this green that was there. So, this is what I used on these. And again, just ribbon that was already in my stash. There is, um, this little ribbon here. And then, um... Also, in my stash, there was some of this ribbon and this, and then that little glitter. They were from one of my YouTube friends. Uh, she is Nicole, and she's Nicolette2806. And she sent me some happy mail in 2021, and it had all these different pretty ribbon so I use some of those on um these little dangles uh, some of that gingerbread paper I just punched out some circles made a little tag uh, this little rusty jingle bell just some buttons little candy cane um 
some of these buttons here. And these were given to me all by Jill. And there was a bag of them in some Happy Mail a few years ago. So I just tied that. More jingle bells. And then up at the top, I just tied a little button to hold everything together. So if you have followed me, you know that I just use whatever I got and just add different little things. So I did this one with um, the green button and this one has a red button. And they are just about alike. So those were my little Saturday morning mates. I want to thank Jill for hosting. I want to thank everybody for watching. Hope that you leave a little comment. Make sure you check your notification bell because sometimes it will switch to um, not receiving the videos. So I want to do um, some more little giveaways um, before Christmas. So just stay tuned and um, see what I have. And that's it for today. I hope that you have a great rest of your day and I will talk with you later.